welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah and I'm the Nerdy Cat Mom and today we're doing something a little bit different. Um, just trying new things out on my channel. See if I like it. See if you like it. If you like it, hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button so you let me know that you like this type of content and hit me up with a comment down below. Okay, so maybe you know, maybe you don't. If you follow me on Instagram, you do. I love Funko Pop. I love Funkos so much, and I'm a huge Harry Potter fan, huge Doctor Who fan, I'm also a huge Pokemon fan, and it has been renewed with the release of Detective Pikachu the movie, and I have not played the game, but I saw the movie and I loved it, it was so adorable and cute. Oh! Okay, so I have found Pokemon Funko Pops. I was blown away. I only, I really, I knew about the Pikachu one, which I don't have actually, um, be from a Funko Pop Swap at Radar Toys, which is one of my local comic shops in the area. They had a Pop Swap, uh, and I went and I saw the, the like 10 inch Pikachu and the normal size Pikachu. And I was like, Oh, that's so cool. But I thought it was a one-off to be honest. I really did. And so I was just like, eh, and I'm, I'm not going to worry about it. I love Pokemon, but I'm not, I'm not going to worry about it. Well, uh, a couple weeks ago, I found this guy at Target ah! and I posted him on my Instagram and I was like, yes. Okay. And then, uh, this last weekend, Courtney and I were at Target and guess what we found? I just had to have him. So, but one thing that I wanted to do with these Funkos is sort of showcase them next to maybe some of the Funkos that I already have just to show, like do a little review on them because they look different to me and I'm not sure if it's just me or what. So, um, let's go ahead and open them up. I'm not squeamish about opening up Funkos. I know some other people are, so if, if you are, look away. Look away. We're gonna do Bulbasaur first. The one thing, one of the things I really love about Funko is they put these cool little backgrounds in here. That's just so cute. It adds to the, um, oh, oh my God. Evidently I've never opened one up that had the, that had this. It's a removable background. That's pretty cool. Um, okay. Well, they have these backgrounds that um, are on the back as well, um, and they really add something to the presentation of the product. Anyway, so there's that, and here's Bulbasaur in his little plastic shield encasement. Come out, Bulbasaur, come out! He is so cute. I saw him on Instagram months before he came out, but he was the only one that we saw at our local Target. Look at him. That bulb really does look like garlic. I sort of never noticed that before. Oh, he's so cute. So there's Bulbasaur and I'll probably end up putting him and Charmander back in their boxes until I have like a display for them. Cause right now my bookshelves are really full overflowing and they're not very well organized with all of my Harry Potter Funkos. So, okay. Now Charmander. Char. Um, I had to get Bulbasaur front. Eventually I think I will get the, um, the Pikachu one. Uh, but until then, I will just have to do with these two. I was starting to get confused because this one, the plastic part is different. Um, the other one came sort of encased. This one comes like this and you just get him out of there. So, um, he also comes with a removable background. And of course these are the the Pokemon type. So for Bulbasaur we have grass type and for Charmander we have fire type. So that's cute. Okay, so let's get Charmander out of his case. 
Oh. Oh, he is so adorable. Look at that smile. The very first episode of Ash finding Charmander, like his Charmander, is so sweet. I love this tail. Like this, they made, they did a really good job making that, that fire look very cute. How cute is that? Okay, so the one thing that I noticed and, and one thing that sort of made me want to make a video is that Charmander and Bulbasaur, they're about the same size. Bulbasaur seems a little bigger because he's just, he's on all fours versus on two. Okay. But here's Charmander and here is a normal like human Funko Pop. Like, there's a size difference there. And I can't decide if I like it or not. So, reason being is that I wish that this were larger. That this sort of was the full three inches in the Funko. Because here's Umbridge. And I'll make them sort of the same. Here's Umbridge and here's Charmander. And Charmander comes up to about here on her. The only reason I can think of that they did it this way is because, you know, Charmander and Pokemon in general, when they're in their first form like this, are quite small. Um, like Pikachu is a mouse Pokemon. Um, so I think they're meant to be smaller than humans, obviously. Um, thus the scale difference, which is kind of nice because if you think like, uh, you know, here's Umbridge, Hagrid is actually quite a bit bigger. He's a six inch, six inch pop. Uh, so that, I mean, I kind of like that they're doing things to scale, but at the same time, they're not real. <laughs> Funkos are, are toys. I mean... Target classifies them as a toy because you can buy Funkos with their, uh, like, buy $50 worth of toys and get $10 off. I've done that before. That's how I got my Niffler. Um, they're a toy. So I guess for me, I would prefer it to be a little bigger. To me, it, it seems like a, a little bit of a jip that they're so small. But on the other end... They're adorable and cute. Like, I am seriously in love with Bulbasaur and Charmander. Oh, so cute. So cute. Okay. Do you guys have any of the Pokemon Funko Pops? Um, or do you collect another one? Another genre? Another fandom? Uh, let me know down in the comments section below. I am a collector of... Not all pops. I don't want the horror pops. But I'm a collector of Harry Potter first, Doctor Who, Lord of the Rings, Disney, and now Pokemon. Oh, they're so cute. I love them. I love them. They're so cute. All right. A little short video for you, but I thought I'd open these up and give you my honest opinion and review of these. Let me know. Uh, by hitting that like button if you like this video and subscribe to my channel for more nerdy content and don't forget to hit that bell notification so you know when I post. All right, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Jar, jar. Urbastor. Urbastor.